This is First Alert Weather. Well, right now we're taking a look here in downtown Topeka, our Cyrus Hotel camera, where the current temperature is 34 degrees, a pretty uh, cold start to the morning here, and fog is very widespread around the city at this time, especially compared to the rest of northeast Kansas. Between Topeka and Lawrence, there does exist some heavy fog, so you'll want to take precaution if you'll be outdoors or traveling on that route on I-70 within the next hour or so before conditions do improve, but overall it is pretty thick. Not particularly here in downtown, though our visibility here on this uh, uh, station monitor is uh, at about zero, so <laughs> that does give you an idea of how thick it is, at least nearby as well. So definitely just want to take those precautions here if we're out early this morning. Last night, we weren't really expecting more than a few bit, uh, patchy bits of fog here throughout the very late hours of last night and early this morning. We had a dense fog advisory issued well out to the west here towards Dodge City, but uh, recently this morning we did have one added a bit further towards the east and uh, some of that has managed to sneak in here into parts of northeast Kansas and especially within Topeka. But conditions elsewhere west of Topeka do seem to be a bit better overall. And as we uh, continue to uh, enter these daylight hours, we will start to see a lot less cloud cover in the sky. And that's going to help, I think, scatter that fog a little bit more as well. Rain chances are going to be low the next several days after lots and lots of sunshine is going to poke through this afternoon. And it's going to stay that way probably through at least next weekend. That'll be the time we have chances above 20% for seeing any rain and it would just be rain uh, because temperatures over this time while they are going to cool down aren't going to be cool enough to really support any types of winter precipitation or things alongside that rain forming. Winds right now are mostly out of the south but uh, calm for the most part here. Kansas City at 8, Emporia, Burlington and Council Grove all at 5 and below and then Concordia there at uh, three miles per hour. Some of us still angling to the north here from winds last night, which again gave us a little bit of a chillier night and a little bit more fog than we expected, but those soon should be reversing themselves. Those winds are gonna be more so out of the south by this afternoon. We could have gusts up to 25 miles per hour. It's something we've come to expect here with these brief days where we warm up by a couple of degrees, maybe five to 10, and those southerly winds alongside it are usually gonna be fairly strong. Not quite the case today, but definitely still a little bit breezy. 51 for tonight, those winds probably continuing a bit as again, we should be much warmer than what we saw last night and the, pretty much even the past couple of nights before that. Partly cloudy skies and then the next several days will be cloudier and uh, probably not as windy, but still going to see a lot of sunshine regardless, not uh, going to really see too many chances of rain forming here as those temperatures probably peak either today or tomorrow. And then by Tuesday, things will be back in the 60s. A very gradual cool down though, as you can see, nothing that is going to send us way back down into the 30s or below freezing anytime soon.